Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today I'm testing the FSR OptiScaler FG mod on the GTX 1650. I've provided the mod link in the description below, so let's get started. First I'll show you how to install the mod properly. Make sure the game you're using already has an upscaling feature, otherwise the mod won't work. Now, just copy all the mod files and paste them directly into the folder where your game's exe file is located. Alright, now open the OptiScaler setup. Next, select the correct .dll file based on your game. For example, Red Dead Redemption 2 uses DirectX 12 in most cases, so I'll go with the first option, dxgi.dll. You should choose the file according to your game's graphics API. After that, pick your GPU type. In my case, I'm using an NVIDIA graphics card, so I'll select the second option. The first one is for AMD or Intel GPUs. And now, after following all that, Go into your game settings and make sure to select NVIDIA DLSS, quality, not FSR quality. If you applied the mod correctly, DLSS will now appear as the upscaler in your settings. Then, press the insert key on your keyboard to open the mod menu. From there, select OptiFG under the frame generation option. After that, save the nanny settings and restart your game. All right, I've restarted the game and it's now loading. Just a reminder, the mod won't work in the game menu, meaning you won't see frame generation options while you're still in the menu. So make sure to fully load into the game, like in actual gameplay, for the mod to activate. Now as you can see, I'm getting FG Active, FB HUD options, and FG Async showing up. Make sure to enable all of these for the mod to work properly. Also, the HUD Active toggle is there to help identify or fix any in-game issues or conflicts. Now I'll be testing games side by side, one running in native mode and the other with the FG mod enabled on my GTX 1650. For the native version, I've used the regular in-game upscaling options, like FSR quality in most cases. With the mod version, everything else stays the same. The only difference is the frame generation mod, so we can clearly see how much extra FPS it gives. Make sure to watch the full video to see the results.
Not welcome here. Go. Must be. لكنه رحل وكسر ذراعه Flares! Survivors! Hurry! I miss you too. Hope you did pick up Spider-Man. 